It's me, Natalie. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hi. My name is Natalie. I post once a week on my channel. I try to do Mondays, but sometimes it turns into Wednesdays. We don't know. If this is the first video you guys are seeing of me, definitely hit that subscribe button. I'd love to be friends with you. I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup routine. Very natural, very easy, very fast. You can do it in like maybe 10 minutes. I'm giving myself like 5 minutes because it's really like... It's the easiest makeup in the world, and it's very natural. Yeah, I think it looks pretty good. If this is your first time seeing me with short hair and you're like, um, Nat, what's up? Definitely check out my last video, I cut my hair. It's different, I know. Anyways, without further ado, let's just get on with the video. Okay, first thing I wanna do is pin back my hair because I don't wanna get my makeup in it. That would just be tragic. So, the first thing I'm going to be using is this anti-aging Neutrogena. I don't wear this all the time, but if I know I'm gonna be outside, I put some on. I know, I'm such an old lady, but I want to keep my face looking as young. I like it because it's oil-free. I can't talk today. If you guys didn't notice, I can't talk whatsoever, which is pretty cool. We love when that happens. I don't know why it makes my skin a little bit red. Cute. We love that. But no, I do like to use a little bit of sunscreen every single day or the days that I am like going out and about just because I want to be young forever. Next, I'm going in with my moisturizer. I am going to take the smallest amount of this by I Do Care. Um, it's the Say You Do um, moisturizer. It's like vitamin C. Am I right? Yeah, vitamin C. It's just very oily. I like literally take like that much. You guys can't even see it because it's such a small amount. And I'm just gonna put it right here, right here, right here, and right here. Little bit right there. Rub that in. Cute. That's really all I do with skincare. Um, and I don't really use these products every single day, but the days that I do, I this is what I use, you know what I mean? So if you guys don't know, I don't like to use liquid foundation only because I touch my face or like I go like that like a lot. It always comes off, which is annoying. What I like to use now is the Sephora, um, it's like a powdered foundation because I think it stays on way better and it looks better on me. And I just use the like little sponge. So gross, I know it's not sanitary, but like it's fine. Um, and I just put that all over my face and I really don't need foundation it's just I really need to tan my face also this is really light compared to this compared to my neck you know what I mean so obviously I can't tan every single day of my life it's just not healthy for my skin so I like to get this stuff even though it's a little bit darker what am I saying it's a lot darker than my face, I know that, but it's fine. We love to catfish. It matches my neck and my body, which is really all that matters to me. And then go underneath the eyebrows, go right here too. Okay, that's literally all I do for my foundation. Then I like to go in with this Fit Me Maybelline, um, like a press powder. I use it for underneath my eyes because I don't use concealer. I use this as like a concealer. It's really weird how I do my makeup, I know. And I lost the brush to this. I used to have like a small one, but now I don't. So now I just use this big foundation brush. And I just pack it underneath my eyeballs. So it looks like I don't have bags under my eyes, which I have really bad bags. I just go underneath my eyeball. And this is um, lighter than my, my pressed powdered one, which is fine. I don't really care. Okay, now that foundation is done, I'm going in with my Too Faced um, Chocolate Bronzer. You guys know I use this almost in, I use this in every single one of my makeup videos. I just, I love it a lot and I'm not running out. I mean, I kind of am, but like it's fine. Let me do it right here. Right here. 
like to do some on my forehead. We want to be tan, but not really, you know what I mean. You guys don't know, I have fake eyelashes. They're eyelash extensions, so all I have to do is just brush them and they're fine. Okay, now for my brows. I'm just going to jump into my brows. I use this uh, Salon Perfect Done in One Brow Powder Pot. I don't know. I literally found this in a drawer and I was like, oh, I'll try it. And it's like my favorite thing ever. And you just like need a little bit too. It matches my eyebrows so good. I don't even know who bought me this or how I even got it. I love it. I used to use um like an eyeshadow. Uh, so I'm really happy I found this. <laughs> boom, boom. Done. Then for my face, what I like to use, my nose is itchy. A lot of people don't use blush. I like blush a lot. So I'm going in with my Too Faced holiday palette from like four years ago. Probably so expired, but like it's fine. I go in with this, I don't even know the shade, Stardust. It's this one. I'm obsessed with it. I see a difference. I don't know if you guys see a difference. It just makes me look so much happier, I think. Or it makes me look like a clown. Like, I, I don't know. No one's, no one's done anything. I like to do it a little bit on my nose, too. This is basically what I do for my everyday makeup routine. I'm telling you guys, it's just so simple. Wait, this isn't what I wanted. Now I'm going to go in with my mist. It's like a vitamin C mist. And I'm done. I'm literally done. It's that easy. That simple, that easy. Yeah, I'm done. I like this because it's so quick and easy and like barely any product. It's like very natural, I think. I'm going to link um, a bunch of the products down below if you guys want to buy it or if you guys have some products that you guys like love and have to have every single day that you guys think that I would love, comment it down below and I'll definitely check them out. That is basically it for today is video. If this is the first time you guys are seeing my short hair, definitely check out my new video. How do we feel about it? Do I look like Lord Farquaad? We don't know. Or we do know and no one's telling me. <laughs> Anyways guys, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Thank you.